Uruguayan Air Force Flight 571 of Fairchild FH-227D crashed into the Andes Mountains on October 13, 1972, while en route from Montevideo to Santiago, Chile, with 45 passengers and crew aboard. The aircraft went down due to severe weather conditions and poor visibility. Miraculously, 16 survivors were found alive more than two months later after enduring a harrowing ordeal of extreme cold, hunger, and isolation in the mountains. Their survival story captivated the world as they resorted to drastic measures, including cannibalism, to stay alive. The rescue efforts faced numerous challenges due to the remote and treacherous terrain, but eventually, a search party located the survivors. The story of Uruguayan Air Force Flight 571 has since been immortalized in books, documentaries, and films, including the acclaimed movie Alive. Following the disappearance of Adam Air, Flight 574, a Boeing 737, on January 1, 2007, en route from Surabaya to Manado in Indonesia, with 102 passengers and crew amidst stormy weather conditions, a rigorous search operation ensued. Days later, wreckage from the aircraft was discovered on the ocean floor near Sulawesi, unveiling potential factors like a malfunctioning navigation system and concerns about crew training inadequacies. Investigations suggested that these issues may have contributed to the accident. Additionally, it is believed that the pilots may have struggled to maintain control of the aircraft during severe weather conditions, ultimately leading to the tragic crash. Transworld Airlines Flight 800 was a Boeing 747 that exploded and crashed into the Atlantic Ocean near East Morica's New York on July 17, 1996, shortly after takeoff from John F. Kennedy International Airport. The cause of the explosion was initially the subject of much speculation and conspiracy theories. However, after a four-year investigation, the National Transportation Safety Board concluded that the explosion was caused by a fuel tank explosion due to an electrical short circuit. The investigation involved the reconstruction of the aircraft from recovered debris and meticulous analysis of the evidence including witness testimonies and forensic examination of the wreckage. Egypt Air Flight 990, a Boeing 767, tragically plunged into the Atlantic Ocean on October 1999 during its journey from New York City to Cairo, resulting in the devastating loss of all lives on board. The crash initially puzzled investigators and sparked intense speculation over its cause. However, analysis of the cockpit voice recorder and flight data recorder, along with other evidence, suggested that the relief first officer deliberately initiated the aircraft's fatal dive, leading to its demise. This revelation prompted scrutiny of pilot mental health screening and training protocols, raising concerns within the aviation community. Aviation authorities tightened regulations, emphasizing the need for thorough psychological evaluations to enhance safety. Air France Flight 447 and Airbus A330 disappeared over the Atlantic Ocean on June 1, 2009, while en route from Rio de Janeiro to Paris, sending shockwaves through the aviation world. The investigation into its disappearance revealed the aircraft crossed an area of severe weather. The pilots encountered malfunctioning speed sensors known as pitot tubes, which led to inconsistent airspeed readings. The pilots struggled to maintain control of the aircraft as it encountered severe turbulence and entered a stall condition. Despite their efforts to recover, Flight 447 tragically crashed into the ocean. In April 2011, the wreckage was located on the ocean floor, the recovery effort deemed one of the deepest and most challenging in aviation history. The crash investigation led to changes in aviation rules to prevent similar tragedies.